Hi everyone, this is Liz from Liz's Paper Loft, and today I'm going to show you how to take a regular envelope like this, a little floppy envelope, and turn it into a cute little treat bag. So um, this is going to be really quick and easy, and here we go. So first of all, you're going to take any size envelope, pretty much will do, and you're going to seal the top, the flap, Oops. and then you're going to score about a half an inch or so. Uh, I'm going to count because this scoreboard is, oops, sorry, is not, um, I don't know, I can't, it's hard for me to measure on here, so I'm just going to count my little notches. One, two, three, four, and if I go over four on all of them, I should, it should work out. So you're going to score really well on both sides. Make it a deep indentation. One, two, three, four. And then do the other side. And then flip it over and do the other one. Basically you want it just to be even on um, your scores to be even. So whatever you do on one side, do it on the other. Oops. Oh, somehow that one got off. Well, I'm not really sure how that worked out like that. Anyway, okay, so now I'm going to cut off the part that you didn't score. So I have some score lines here and here and here. And I'm going to cut off the top. And it really doesn't matter how much you cut off. It just depends however much, however big you want your bag to be. So I just cut off about an inch. And now you just fold up and take care, um, really crease your score marks both ways. These are great for little kids. You could put out quite a few of them in no time. And envelopes are fairly reasonable. Okay. So now you're just going to open up to make it into a bag. And the way you do that is you Kind of crease the sides a little bit. And when you get to the bottom, it's always nice to use your bone folder just to poke. So you can, as for the edges, you just flap them down like on a little box, like you would on a package, and you just grab a little bit of tape. And tape it down. Oops. And that's it. And then you can fold the top. There's your put your stuff your treats inside. Fold the top. And you can do one of two things. What I did on this one is I used one of Emma's dies, the XL label die. And I just fold cut it out, folded it over. Use some adhesive, so you could do something like that, or you could just staple the top or fold it down and punch holes and put ribbon, anything you want after you decorate it. It's very cute, very easy, and it's not a big thing to fill up for candy. All right, thanks for watching, and this is Liz at Liz's Paper Loft. Thanks, bye-bye.